hello guys and welcome back to my youtube channel and in this video i will try to learn you a new trick for creating new components very easy for first time you must go to the google web browser and type here with a librarian please go to this site ultralibrarian.com first time you must to create uh, an account and to after that you will log in to the website and now we have a lot of components available in this website for example we can google it for a controller from st stm 32 f 100 search you can see here you have a lot of uh, variant but in general most of them are with the same number of pins and with the same footprint we will take the first one in this table you can check uh, which symbols uh, are available which footprint it's available and you can see a uh, correspondence between the pins here if one of the pin correspond to the pulse prime pin it signalize here you see the pin number eight it signalize here and uh, our symbol is split in two parts part a with all of the pins and part uh, B only with the power supply pins and grounds also the 3D model for this footprint it's available here you have to follow only few simple steps to download it and to use in your project you will hit the download button and depends on your program that you use in our case Altium Designer we will select it here Altium Designer and we download the, the symbol in general you must uh, wait a few seconds up to one minute depend on the complexity of the, the part now the part was already downloaded we open it in his location we will extract all the files here and now uh, our symbol it's this one we have a structure like this which contains uh, all of the all, all the parts this is the program which uh, it's uh, used to import the symbol in Altium and this is the 3d model for this footprint now we sit we switch to the Altium designer and we follow few simple steps you must go to the file tab open please locate the last footprint that you downloaded this one and you always must open this script altium script project hit open 
button and as you can see now we have uh, the project here we must open this import file and after that we run the this command run or f9 after this to finish the importing pro process you must to select the text document file from our folder open and the import will start you will receive this notification some audio version has issue with the schematics fonts but it's not something uh, critical you can press ok and the import will start in you must to wait a few seconds and after that our component will appear here in this tab the project tab from Altium and we can go to check the symbol this is the symbol which contains the two parts that we already mentioned the symbol was split in two one symbol contains only the power pins and grounds and the other symbol contains the rest of the, the pins to check the the footprint you must open the PCB lib and open the PCB library and uh, we have uh, this footprint This footprint contains all of the details regarding our symbol and you can check always the parts that you imported from other sources with uh, the data sheet to check if the size of the pads are the correct one if the orientation of the pins are the correct one if the pin number one it's located on this side in our case or on this side or on this side depends on the component but it's better always to check this information with the information from data sheets so you can uh, reuse this symbol in your project if you want for example you can copy this entire part go to your local library and paste it here and now you have the symbol ready and the same thing with the footprint you, gonna, you can take it from here copy the footprint go to your PCB lib and paste here the new component and now we have here the new footprint which contains all of the details the 3d model the footprint the 
overlays and the other marking depends on the client specification or the company request if you want to search for any type of components you can type it here for example ll4148 diode and you have a lot of glass diode which are in this type of case and you can check it and download it in the same manner like the previous component the easy way it's to download select your program wait few seconds Extract the files Go back to Altium Designer Open the project Open the import file, execute run command, select the text file, not this one, this one, start the import. Only few seconds are required to have a new part in your library. This is the symbol in this case, but if you don't like it, you can exchange it with a normal symbol for a diode. And for the footprint, we have this three variant, as you can see we have a very nice 3d model with this marking for the cathode and we have uh, three variants of the footprint the normal one a large version of the footprint and the master footprint and I think this is the easiest way to import symbols from the Ultra Librarian site and to save a lot of time which can be re reused to other topics. Thank you for you are watching this video. I hope I give you a, lo a lot of helpful information and see you in the next videos bye bye